big deal for Elmo, okay? My name is Dami, that song for Dami, and you are watching Miss Adventures with Dami. Welcome and or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, you should know that I do self-love, beauty, and lifestyle content here on my channel. And if you're returning, hello bestie, I missed you. So, today's video is brought to you by my thrifting addiction. It's not a problem if I recognize it. I went thrifting pretty much all last weekend. So I figured that I would make a video out of it and show you guys what I got and how I plan on styling a bunch of these pieces for the two whole weeks of spring that we get down here in the South. All right, let's get started. All right, so this is my first piece. It is this super cute cropped long sleeve shirt. I got this at Goodwill for like $4.99. I saw the color and then when I picked it up, I was like, yes, immediately yes. This is originally from the brand Arizona Jeans Co. I'm pretty sure it's like a JCPenney's brand, but I thought it was so cute. It's in a 2XL. This is just like the perfect amount of crop for me. Like I hate when it's too short but when it's too long so this is perfect and you know obviously it's pink i love that it's long sleeve so i can definitely only wear this for the next couple of weeks because we don't get spring for very long down here but i'm glad that i picked this up when we still have a little bit of chill in the air so i can enjoy it a little bit i just love it all right so next up we have this super cute piece i love this so, 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 so much. I found this in Plato's closet, and at first I wasn't gonna pick it up because I was like, ugh, it's white, and overalls literally never fit me. Like, I cannot tell you how many years I have wanted a pair of just like cute jean overalls or like an overall dress. So I was like, no, but something told me to pick this up because it was only $8, and I was like, I'm just gonna kid with myself, and I'm gonna try it on, and it, fit it's so comfortable the pockets are actually real so like i can actually put my phone in here and all the pockets in the front are real and the ones in the back this material is really really comfy i think it's like i think it's like 98 percent cotton and the other two percent is spandex so it is so comfortable as you can see it's like a very cute but modest length especially on me and i just love this and you know we have like a little off the shoulder moment or I could do like a crisscross. It's just so cute and I was so happy. It's not like the most flattering to my tum tum, but honestly, I don't care. I'm just happy that it fits. Sometimes you just gotta buy something and put it on your body and be like, that works for me. So that is what I did and I'm so happy that I did. All right, so here are our next pieces. I got these shorts from Plato's Closet. I think that the brand is originally from Target. It's Universal Thread, so it's either from Target or Walmart. Either way, I have another pair of shorts that are like my go-to shorts that I wear all the time, and they are the same brand. These are just in a darker wash than the ones that I have, but they are still comfortable and they fit me like a glove. I think they were like $5 and I was like, I cannot pass these up. It's about to be shorts weather and I need more shorts. It's really hard for me to find shorts that are both cute and flattering. And honestly, this shade of denim is going to go with pretty much everything and obviously it will lighten up over time. So had to get these. And then this top I got from Goodwill, it's from the brand Eddie Bauer, which I have recently started seeing that brand in the thrift stores like a lot around here. So I don't know what's going on with that, but this is a very expensive brand. Like I looked them up, they're not cheap. So anytime I find pieces from that brand and it fits, I get it. And this is super cute. It's just like a white top, honestly, almost a crop top, but not really. I would probably wear it dressed down like this, like very casual with shorts or jeans or something. You know, just go out, go run errands, go record, go edit, whatever. It's just cute. I think it was like $3.99 and I was like, okay, whatever. We love a t-shirt moment. So I love it. It's super comfortable and a steal for the quality that I know this brand is. So yeah. All right, so next I have this super cute crop top. It's originally from American Eagle, but I got it from Plato's Closet, also for like four, five dollars, something like that. I just thought what it says on it is super cute. It says good times ahead. It has like a little alien and a peace sign and a crown. Y'all see it, y'all see it. And I just thought it was super cute. You know, obviously it's a crop top. I live for a crop top moment. 
literally always and i can just wear like a cute skirt or shorts like this with it you know maybe like with some jewelry or some bracelets or literally just like put my hair up in a bun and go climate change is upon us and we all know that it's about to be like 106 degrees this summer so i wanted to make sure that i am cute and comfy the entire time all right i also got this cute sweater vest i picked this up from goodwill i think it was like six dollars the brand is morona which i'm pretty sure was like an old target brand i think this is gonna be a great transition piece with the exception of summer because it is a little thick i'll probably be gonna wear this like all through spring and fall and in winter i have already worn it once so i am pretty excited as you can see i keep rolling it up because it's like this kind of awkward length that i don't like i roll it up just because i kind of like that whole vibe of like a sweater vest being like rolled on top of like jeans or whatever but yeah this is super cute i can definitely see me wearing this for the rest of the season and it's like right in my brand aesthetic color so picks this up all right so here is another sweater and i know y'all are probably thinking dominique why sweaters you know it's gonna be hot i know but i cannot resist and also like i love a little investment piece so this is a cropped sweater and it is actually supposed to be cropped i'm not just cropping it myself this is in an extra large it's from abercrombie and fitch which i have never in my life been able to fit into something from abercrombie and fitch all right so this is a big deal this is a big deal for elmo okay but i love this you cannot tell me that this little crop sweater was not made for me i look so good i look so good definitely fits the vibes for you know spring and i will also be putting this in my fall stuff as soon as our two weeks of spring are up. I love this and I'm so excited to be wearing it. All right, so next up is this dress. I got it from Play-Doh's Closet. The brand is Universal Thread, but this is super cute. I think it's like a high-low or if it's just unintentionally doing that because of my boobs and my butt, but it's really cute and I love it a lot. I love how it has like the subtle striations on it and it kind of changes down here. So like up here, it's diagonal and then here it's just like regular horizontal striping i don't know i just thought it was super cute and you know but i just thought this was so adorable you know giving like springtime goddess sings with birds runs in the fields with bees you know i thought it was a cute little moment and who doesn't love a sundress you know so now we have this cute dress i got this from plato's closet but it is originally from sheen i consulted like everyone i know about whether or not i should get this dress because i was like oh i was like the tum tum she's really poking out and then my best friend was like but girl the booty she poking out too so i got it obviously i thought it was really cute and i honestly don't know where i would go in this dress but i love it i'm happy to have it in my closet now so i would probably no i would definitely wear this with like some white leggings or like some stockings underneath but I think this is super cute. I love this. I love a bodycon. I think that this is supposed to be more of like a straight dress, but honestly, you know, your girl, your girl got curved. So it did not turn out that way, but it's fine. So I really like this. It's cute. I think it was like $5 and you know, fast fashion gonna end up in somebody's closet. So <laughs> you ain't gotta pay big money for it. You know what I mean? All right, and lastly, I picked up this cute lavender sweater from Goodwill. It's originally from H&M though. I love this and I also have like a cute lavender skirt that's like not exactly the same lavender but they're both from H&M so I feel like it'll work out. And I'm thinking about trying to do like a little monochrome moment with it. But for now, I picked this up and I got this before I got the dress and I was like, ooh, that's gonna be cute. So I might wear it like this with like some cute wedges or sandals or something. The only thing I hate about the sweater is that it's like one of those fake mop sweaters, but it's fine. I love this, it's so cute. I'm so happy that I decided to get it because I had to fight real hard. I had to fight all my demons in the dressing room because I was like, girl, you're not gonna wear that. And I was like, no, you will wear it because you're gonna throw out everything else. So you'll have to wear it. So. I got it and 
I am excited. Now that I have it, I'm really excited and I will be wearing it. All right, y'all. So that is everything that I have thrifted so far for the upcoming spring season. I am so happy that I found so many bright, colorful pieces to have in my wardrobe now. So that is everything I got and a little bit of how I will be styling it in the spring. So you know the drill by now. Please like this video down below if you enjoyed it. Comment and let me know which piece was your favorite and let me know whether or not you've been doing any of your own thrifting for the upcoming season. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already because I love seeing returning besties here on the channel. So I hope that everyone is happy, healthy, and thriving and I will see you next time. Bye!